guys, John here. Um, just a quick video to highlight some features of Blue Line, um, in particular the move left, move right, and delayed drag. Um, these are features that we find will be very useful with Blue Line and with any mouse alternative or joystick, um, uh, but especially one that's Bluetooth, like the Blue Line. For the sake of this demonstration, I've connected the Blue Line already. Um, the Blue Line is obviously connected through the settings menu, um, accessibility and assistive touch. Um, you can find out how to do that within our other video to do with, to do with introducing Blue Line to you where Dave shows you how to do that. It's slightly different to normal, so it's worth having a look if you're not sure. You can see the assistive touch menu is on uh, and that cursor is on the right hand side. And you can see if I wiggle the joystick, it comes back alive and you've got the mouse cursor there. Also for the sake of this demonstration, I've set up two switches in the left and right 3.5 millimeter jack. So you'll see a yellow switch and a red switch. And the buttons have been set to the default functions for the left and right button. So we have a left click and the assistive touch menu on the right button as default. However, I've changed the middle button function to uh, work for delayed drag, which I'll show you in due course. So straight into it. Um, the move left and move right function are quite an interesting function because you can use it for lots of different things such as cycling through your menus. Um, so I'll show you that straight away, it's quite easy to show you. <laughs> Simply press the move left and move right and you can see cycles through the apps, cycles through any, any app that will uh, have the functionality to swipe left, swipe right, move left, move right through the options within the app. But obviously a really good function for move left, move right would be within Kindle app or iBooks where you could use it as a page turner and seamlessly page, page turn through your book as you're reading along. Nice and simple there. The best way to show you delay drag is to take you into the notes app and show you using a selection of text because delay drag gives you the function of selecting more than one thing on the screen and performing actions to that thing, to that group. So the best way of showing you is to simply hover over any of the text hold down the delay drag button you'll see the red light comes on and then you can move across the text and select the section of text that you want to uh, do something to and perform an action to press the middle button again and you get the list come up so you've got your usual cut copy replace change the fonts etc um, and you can do all of those um, as standard to more than one selection rather than having to hold the button down and move the joystick at the same time I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you learned a bit more about the functions of Blue Line. Um, and if you have any further questions, do get in touch. Um, but above all, stay safe and well, and um, we hopefully will speak to you soon.